What's going on guys? Dan Kell here from Liquidation Pros and in this video I'm going to be unboxing some Costco clothing. Um, this was a bulk liquidation buy. I bought two pallets of clothing. Um, it's all different mix, uh, men's, women's, uh, different sizes, different conditions. Uh, most of it we have already gone through and we've actually sorted, sorted it based on different pricing categories. And I've pulled out a few select items that I do want to sell individually. But for a lot of it, I was thinking that I would offer up some uh, some wholesale lots. So what I've done is we've priced uh, items that are like 10 to $15 is one category. So that's like the low end stuff. Um, 15 to $24.99 is another category. And then basically 25 up. It can go anywhere up to about 40 to 50 is about the cutoff. Um, some of the select items that were over 50 50 to hundred dollars I pulled out that I'm going to sell individually but the majority that's that only end up being about 40 to 50 pieces of um, a 1200 piece lot so it's a lot of um, like nice mid-grade resellable clothing um, that I was thinking it may make more sense to sell off in bulk lots as opposed to uh, take the time to resell on my end every piece individually because I have a lot of other lots that I'm working on and I really need to move this inventory a little bit quicker um, this time of year so with that being said what we've done like i said is we sorted the different categories um so i have 15 below is here uh it's just one box of many that we have i haven't um opened this since we sorted it and honestly i don't know what you know these first few pieces are going to be so what we would, you would do is you would get six pieces of this price range you get eight pieces of the mid-grade price range which is your 15 uh, to 25 so you get eight of those and you would get two pieces of the select uh, higher end $25 or more uh, and that's at, uh, Costco retail price which actually ends up being close to the actual resale value um, Costco's pricing is actually lower than M than normal like MSRP pricing it's not inflated at all it's pretty pretty true to like eBay or Poshmark value so let's dive in uh, and show you what some of the items would look like This one open here. All right, so right off the bat, we have a looks like a honeydew Chanel legging. Uh, here's a, and I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna undo this whole box. It just gives you an idea. Here's an ugly Christmas sweater, new with tags. That should be good for next year. Here's a whole bundle of leggings. They're all new, but it looks like they're missing tags. And the other, that's the other thing is if the item was um, one category up, but doesn't have tags, but still in like, like new condition, we would downgrade it a value. So um, a whole set of say like these four or five piece leggings might've been $24.99, but they got downgraded because they don't have the tags, but they do still have um, the inserts in them. You can see it still has like the cardboard insert for folding. So they're still brand new, never worn, but they were just an open box item. Um, and once again, this is the lower grade stuff here. You would get a, uh, what brand is this? This is called Trinity, so Trinity Fleece. Here is an Eddie Bauer women's sleep set, a two piece um, Henley sleep set. So as you can see there, that's an open box item. So that was probably a little bit of a higher grade. That might have been a $20 item that got downgraded. Here's a flannel. Um, this is going to be uh, Jack's girlfriend, new with tags. Nice long sleeve flannel. It's another flannel shirt. This is a men's. Uh, this is just Jack's flannel. Uh, let's see. We have another Eddie Bauer um, two-piece women's sleep set gray color um, those those pajamas do really well um, this is called vintage america just looks like a long sleeve shirt so really good inventory this is like i said the lower end stuff you'd only get six pieces of these in the lot um, and though i don't know if i mentioned the price but the price for the lot's going to be 99 dollars for 16 items um, here's a few more here's a couple Brand new pairs of Mariano's, oh, Mario, Mario Serrani um, women's dress pants. 
So one size large, one size extra large. And what we would also try to do is we wouldn't try to overload, uh, for instance, with like the Christmas sweater. Uh, I wouldn't give you six ugly Christmas sweaters. I, I feel like you'd do better off if you have a good mix of inventory. So we would definitely mix it up. Uh, here's a nice Orvis flannel. Uh, ladies Orvis medium. So uh, I think that gives you a pretty good idea. Looks like there's some, um, some underwear, brand new box. Or it might be an open box, but it looks like they're all... They've never been used. Um, honeydew. There's some uh, ladies' underwear. Some heavy duty socks. So, I'm going to go ahead and uh, throw this stuff back in real quick and let's check out the next grade up, which would be the $15 to $25 items. So, $15 to $25 retail. Or it could be over 25, it got downgraded because it's missing tags. So that's gray. Yeah, we'll open up a uh spoon here. Alright, now normally items in this in this lot um, and the next lot up, I would or the price range I normally would sell on eBay um, the lower end stuff that stuff there a lot of times I would do bundles of it um, or I take it to the flea market some of it if it's ringing up at like close to 15 to 20 I will sell that's the other thing I should make mention that um, anything that's either the lower grade that's missing tags or has like slight flaws appears to be used um, we've already pulled all that out so that's stuff that I'm going to be selling myself um, separately from these lots. These are supposed to be good um, good selling inventory for you guys. So my main goal is to provide good deals so I can move inventory faster. So the last thing I want to do is give you a box of stuff you're not going to be able to sell. So this should be pretty good selling items. So now we're, into, we're getting into our mid-grade um, items, which you would get eight of these. This here is a 32 degrees heat. Uh, this is a really popular jacket. I sold a bunch of these. It's the hooded puffer jacket. Um, on Amazon, I was getting anywhere from like $30 to $40 for this jacket. So that's a really good deal for that one. Um, and the reason I probably didn't pull that one out for myself is because I only have one of them. So to create the listing and all that may not necessarily be worth my time, but it's probably, it probably could be worth yours. Um, two packs of leggings by Felina. Uh, I'm guessing those are probably just over the $15 mark. Let's see what we got here. A uh, pair of Tommy Hilfiger jeans. Uh, these still do have the tags on them. So size 14, Tommy Hilfiger. Um, they are women's, just your basic women's Tommy jeans. Um, brand new condition. Let's see what else we have here. It's a big pack, a six pack of uh, ladies trail socks. I have sold these before. These do sell quick. You can look them up. The Kirkland ladies um, mer merino wool. Those are real good sellers. Stuff like that will be in there. Uh, let's see what we have here. This is a nice Nautica hoodie. Women's size small. Um, comfy lounge set by Felina. See what else we have. These are going to be champion, uh, champion jogging pants with the big logo. These were, these may have been. Uh, I don't see tags on these, but these were probably either next grade up or they were rated nineteen ninety nine. So we left them in because they they would still be worth probably more than fifteen. And here's another pair of those as well, with the tag. So give you an idea what those are. Let's see what we have here. This is an Orvis uh, vest. So, super nice men's large vest. And navy color. And I was going to see if it said the, what the, the type was so you could look it up. But if you look up Orvis vest, I'm sure you can find it. Navy Orvis vest. Nice item there. Uh, it's an Ellen Tracy 
Uh, sweatshirt. Not sure about that brand, but let's see what we have here. So these are Eddie Bauer um, Buffalo plaid sleep sets. And it says the original price rate on there is $19.99 from Costco. So that's a good deal there. Another 32 degrees uh, men's jacket with tags. Just ready to be sold. Uh, let's see what we got here. Another jacket here. It's a vest by uh, Weatherproof. Weatherproof vest. Ladies. Very nice condition. Uh, I'm seeing a couple other sweatshirts here. Uh, this is a hooded sweatshirt by Cyrus. And I'm not sure if that's... Nothing too special in that one. Uh, Honeydew lounge set. Just trying to rip through a couple of these quickly. Uh, Kirkland uh, hooded pullover or hooded full zip jacket, ladies. So that should give you a good idea of what to expect. You would get about six, or I'm sorry, eight of these items. No champion. Eight of these, uh, six of the other ones, and then two of the next box to equal. Um, 16 items. So 16 items for 99 bucks. All in good resellable condition. Here's a brand new jacket, weatherproof vest. Um, with tags, ready to go. And here's another one of those as well. Size large. So That's it for that box. And just to give you an idea, I have, I think, probably 10 to 15 of these boxes full of clothes that are all ready to be um, shipped out. So what we'll do is we'll just at random, we'll curate a box as orders come in. If you're interested in ordering one, um, you can simply email the address that will be down in the links below. It's going to be uh, contactliquidationpros at gmail.com and you can simply just say, uh, I would like to order one reseller box or two or how many of you would like. Or if you need more information, if you want to get a quote on shipping, uh, I just need your zip code. It's, these are not free ship. These are going to be, you have to pay for shipping. Uh, I'm in Maryland. Um, the surrounding states, um, in my region, my area, it's probably going to be 15, maybe 20 bucks. Uh, as you go further out towards the west, it's going to go up. It could go up anywhere to like 30 or, or more, depending. So keep that in mind as you're ordering. Um, but shoot me an email if you'd like to place an order or if you need to get a quote on shipping. Um, the last box here is going to be your higher or higher end stuff, and we wanted to include at least two of these items. And you know, the hope is that at least with two of these two items in this box, you at least make back half your money. So that's why I'm including these. All right, so let's see what we have here. So this is our high grade twenty-five hour and up. This is a Pendleton wool uh, men's flannel shirt. Excellent condition with tags. Nice selling item there. Here we have a Columbia men's jacket. Um, this is probably a 60 or 70 dollar jacket, if not at least a hundred. But um, as you can see, it has the size sticker, but I don't believe it has the actual retail tag. So the retail tags are broken off so there's no retail tags sometimes you check the pockets you will find tags uh, this one doesn't have tags so this is a new jacket without tags but you know it's easily a fifty dollar um item on ebay right now the way it sits without tags uh, here's a a double extra large weatherproof uh jacket so brand new with tags Black and good color. We've seen a lot of um, winter stuff in this load. I did get a lot of winter clothing because winter is still selling well right now. Uh, if you get these boxes quick, you should be able to get, get the jackets listed and start making some money back right away. Uh, this is a Jerry brand men's, um, what do they call it? Bear, uh, it says Bearwood workwear jacket. So it's just a, a men's like uh, work jacket from Jerry. Here's another Pendleton um, flannel shirt. Here's a nice spider. Was this the uh, quarter zip? Or it might even be half zip 
pullover, spider brands, a, a ski and um, winter sports company, which they sell really well. Look these up. So that's a great piece there. That's probably without tags. It's new without tags. Uh, I'd say at least 40 bucks for that shirt alone. And look, here's another one. And then here's another Pendleton. And uh, another Jerry uh, jacket. So really nice inventory here. You would get two items out of this box. What do we have here? This is a uh, BC clothing, real heavy uh, Sherpa lined, full zip fleece, super nice quality, heavy duty jacket. Uh, might as well pull the last one out. It's a, actually just another weatherproof, another large weatherproof jacket. So kind of gives you an idea. Most of these items here, uh, there's one more in here, sorry. This here is another a women's weatherproof jacket. So, I had a list. So going back, some of the brands you could uh, expect to receive, 32 degrees, uh, a lot of that stuff. Some, there's some Adidas, um, BC, Buffalo, Calvin Klein, Champion, Columbia, DKMY, Eddie Bauer. This is just to name a few. Um, English Laundry, Felina, Jerry, GH Bass, Hager, Greg Norman, uh, Hillary Radley, Jessica Simpson, uh, Kirkland, Honeydew, Levi's, Lucky, uh, Maddie M, Max and Mia, Monkey Flannel. Nautica, Orvis, Puma, Pendleton, um, Skechers, so uh, what else, Tommy. So as you can see, there's just uh, tons of name brand inventory in these uh, box lots that I'm going to be putting together. Uh, if you're interested, uh, shoot me an email, contact liquidationpros at gmail.com. The, the, uh, Link will be down in the description below with some more information. Um, you will need to uh, pay for shipping, so you can also shoot me an email and get a shipping quote. Uh, I will need your zip code for that. So anyhow, I uh, hope you uh, liked the video. Please consider subscribing if you haven't already done so. Uh, always try to uh, add value and add content about reselling, uh, especially when it comes to buying and selling liquidation products. So. Hope you liked the video. Uh, give me a thumbs up and I'll talk to you in the next video. Thanks guys. See ya.